But, but, but. What? And so as soon as you die, you genes. will not continue. With this. Yes, but you, uh, if you have children, they live, through, they. And what is your but child? But at the same time, time, you do not continue to exist. They That's may right. have a picture of you. I okay, so now you existed, but now you have two children that are now stopping me from going through that green light. And now eating resources. What are you fucking they talking need, about? Human beings are organic, right? You need resources. You also need green light, too. Okay, so every human being thinks they're obligated to have another fucking batch of human beings, right? For what? Pull out kids. For what? What are you having human beings for? What, wow, what's the so objective goal of having human it, beings? It, it, so here's the thing. If you think, so I don't have any children, just saying. But if you think my None of us have children. I'm going to corner you here in a second, so go ahead. If you think that my children are in the way of you having Absolutely. life the way that you want, then my it's my children's obligation and my obligation to teach them to delete you. Because now, at this point... That's fine. You at, can delete me as long as your children get deleted at this, together at, the, at, at this the same point, time. At this point, you are keeping my children and my my legacy from continuing. So, at this okay, point, then you what's become your legacy the enemy. For, then? What the fuck is your legacy for? What, are you, what is your continuing genes going for? To continue existing. For what? For the same reason... Because you're a parasitic fucking organism. That's what. You're going to keep continuing the breed so that you can keep continuing on and this taking your slings. Yeah. I mean, There's I mean, no real meaning to life. It is a very negative outlook. Okay, then what's the positive outlook? To suffer and live for what? It, it, it doesn't matter when you suffer. die. You don't just suffer throughout life, do you? You, you have got a, sprinkles of joy and happiness throughout your fucking life. Well, then that's 90. what you're living for. For what? It doesn't matter when you die. Do you take that happiness? This, with this you? doesn't really seem like a problem. See, for now me. he's going to go down this fucking. Road. This seems like a problem for you, Greg. You see where I'm going? Yeah, I I see that you just told the entire viewership that I'm a nihilist. You're beyond a nihilist. I'm a misanthropist. And you should probably seek medical help. No, but that's a that's a reality check. There, there's no real meaning to life. It, it's it's not really that you cornered me. You cornered yourself. Yeah. No, I didn't. What did I quarter myself on? Yeah, you got it. <laughs> a realistic outlook on reality? That, that is your outlook. That is your outlook. I mean, outlook there right are on. arguments to be made for both right. sides. You took it to an extreme. I, I you took it to an extreme. I understand your side. I just sat here and enjoyed it. Okay, right. so you're going to breed, continue to take resources off this planet, which makes you a parasite, and your breed... Every baby's a parasite, and then the eight billion other motherfuckers that are eating this planet away and a counting, parasite and counting and counting. That's, counting. The, that's the point. And then they, we want to go to different solar systems and planets, and then take those resources for what? For existence. For exi yeah. yeah. And I, what I is existence? Elon Musk, you want me to go to Mars? I'm down. Number one. Yeah, I'm but there's no Mars real meaning. Be. There's no Mars. real meaning besides selfishness. Is what I'm getting at. Our whole Musk. entire biology is based off of taking and consuming. Look, I'm just, I'm just telling. We're you. parasites. And, I'm just telling. And I know you, you don't like to accept that, but we are parasitic. You consider humans. yourself a parasite. You I, are a parasite. I consider myself a. Okay, don't eat for a month. That just has just as much don't right eat for as a month. anything else. Don't on drink this, water. Don't take else. any resources from the planet. You just told him to basically not drink water for a month. Right. That will lead to his death. You can't say that. Well, then he's not a parasite. Then if he can't, if he can do that, then he's not a parasite because all of us need energy to live. Don't and not drink. This, for a this month. makes this argument makes no, no it sense does at all. Not. You need you need energy from other resources, right? From this planet. If you're out, which makes you parasitic because look, you can't survive without I, taking other resources. This humor and call yourself a parasite. You're a parasite. I am not a parasite. We are all. Parasites. I am a living. Here we go. Breathing. We're all parasites. Creature. Here we go. We're all parasites. And every, if you, within your point of view, every single creature and thing on this planet, or anywhere yeah, else, all the, world, the other animals besides human beings stay in their lane. Human beings are selfish and take more than. Think they about this. With what you just said, you just caught everyone watching this fucking podcast a parasite. I'm a parasite. They human might beings take offense are. To that. You can take offense all you want, but that's reality. I'm just saying. Do you eat food? Everyone eats food. You need... Everyone drinks okay. water. So when you move, just listen to me. When you move, you consume what? Energy. 
Even me Calories. doing this Eddie, right here. Any action or movement yes. consumes energy. Action. Calories. Any negative action or positive reaction has a negative consequence to it. As in intaking calories and expending calories. Right. You need energy, and how do we get energy? We consume. consume. Everything consumes. Drinking booze. Everything on this planet consumes. Don't be stupid. You eat food, and that gives you energy so that you can continue moving. I only eat food on Saturdays. Yeah, okay. If you only ate food on Saturdays, you'd be dead. You do not only eat food on Saturdays. That's, I, I that's do eat some pretzels. Bullshit. Right There's no way you live all week and not only eat food on Saturday. That okay. is a bullshit fucking accusation for yourself. Okay. No fucking way you do. I eat some pretzels during the week. That's about it. No fucking way. You got a pizza box sitting on your fucking table out there. Oh, I had pizza yesterday because he came over. That was good pizza too, by the way. I, I I personally believe that what is Earth? You have a very negative, pessimistic, pessimistic call it. What outlook is it called? on life. Oh, I feel like I was accidentally in the middle of that because you guys were having a moment. And, and, and I, I, I'm not telling you that I'm not. I'm not saying it's a negative thing. Right. I'm just saying we're parasitic, right? Like I don't think we should go past our solar system. If we make it there, then we deserve to be I don't, there. I don't think we At do. some point in time, though, if it keeps going the way it's going, we're going to have to. Right. you, you got to accept that. I don't that. think, like, like, we control, like, all the deer population, go out and hunt, right? Like, we do all this shit, but yet we never do it the human race. What are we, above all the other animals? Oh, so you want to do some fucking purge yeah, bullshit. Yeah. Yeah. Well, the purge is already No, 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 I'm not. There's, there's ways to do it without murdering people, and it's called not having sex for a while. And getting the population down to a controlled amount. But you know what will ever happen? Nobody will ever stop having sex. So, I think the earth is going to... So your solution to the human problem of, you know, resources and everything is just not fucking. That is a simplistic way of taking care of it. But you know that people aren't going to stop doing that. So I'm, I want to say something right here. Why do you think people, like Bill Gates... People that have no children... Do you think they're, they're going to think along the same lines of that? Yeah, most of them do. Actually, they don't. They have no. Uh, they have no horse in the race anymore, so they don't really. You know, statistically, smart because they, people don't at, have at babies this, over dumb people. Because it's fiscally irresponsible. Right. Yeah. To, to, to I'm an antinatalist. You know what? That I would. Means? I would not create something if I could not take care of it. Okay, so you're going to bring a baby in to suffer then. You're because saying that life it's is suffer. suffering, you don't suffer. I, I would make that baby. You, your life, life is full of joy, twenty four seven, and you're not getting old and you're decaying. I entertain myself. Yeah, but <laughs> deep down, subconsciously, you know you're getting older and you're decaying. Everybody does that, and life sucks, right? Ninety percent of the time, life sucks. Oh. Come on, Ken, don't be a fucking bullshitter. Life sucks all the time. You get little sprinkles of fucking little happy juice throughout it, and then the rest of the time, it sucks. So don't fucking play this fucking life's fucking. Ah, yeah, I, never, I never said that. Well, you know I'm right, man. Life. life sucks. Your parents fucked. You're here. You didn't have a say in it. I love my parents. I, didn't I enjoyed. Say you I didn't. enjoyed my childhood. Yeah, childhood. I had a decent life. Okay, now as adulthood, you know life sucks. Now I just do what I can. <laughs> do what I want. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Optimistic Ken. Ken Copter over there. I, 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 I'm just telling you right now, you have a very negative... Yeah, you're trying to dodge the, You're trying to be optimistic. I'm, I'm not You're trying to have anything. hope in life. That's the difference between me and you. And you're trying to project your thoughts yes. onto him just because you think that you were fucking cheated. No. There you go. Life, he's trying to say that life is optimistic. He's looking at You hope. think that you were cheated because you were born. So do you. No. I okay, never said so that. life is happy for you. I've never said that. Okay, then what is life to you? I'm just going. No, 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 is more right now, in other words, do I do I enjoy being on this planet Earth right now? Right, I do. Bullshit. You complain about if 
YouTube. I can go, I can go, I can complain about anything I fucking want to. If YouTube it's is my YouTube. prerogative to fucking complain about YouTube. whatever the fuck. We'll find something else. Yeah, we'll do something else. Like what? Anything I'll, else. I'll go live on a fucking boat and fish. Exactly. All day. I'll live. I'll. I'll, I'll oh, you're going to go fish. I'll on an island. You don't have an island. No, I, I'll spend $200,000. That's, where, that's, that's where, where optimistic island. fucking views come in. They're not based in reality. I don't care what you guys think. You guys are trying to base what you view at life just to get by, but reality is. It's, it's just a very, it's just a very negative outlook on life, and I. Think What's the positive no, 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 outlook no, 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 on he's, life? He's being downright fucking goddamn outlandish. No, I'm not. I'm being real. You uh, guys are I guess, being. I guess that's it for the episode, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for watching. Episode 13 of the podcast, Troy is, you know, content on being an asshole. I am joined here by Mr. Casey and Mr. Guy. Greater Guy, depending upon anything.